Hi, I'm Colton Cole and welcome to Hold The Phone, a new format from Versus and GifGaf that provides undisputed A to Z on some of the most controversial T's and C's in football contracts. GifGaf are changing the game with their signature good contracts providing unrivaled independence and flexibility for members. But this is something football owners haven't always done. We're running through some of the most outrageous contracts clauses of all time, working out which ones are true and which ones are false, with the help of some special guests who have answered our call to come on the show. Welcome to Gif Gaff, hold the phone. I've got some great artists with me. I've got Paigey Keiki and I've got Young's Teflon. So those are not familiar with your work, give me a brief introduction about what you do. I've been doing music since 2012, so a long, long time. I'm also an actress and an influencer, and I'm still here doing music to this day. Brilliant. Um, yeah, your boy Young Cephalon, South London representative. I released my first mixtape in 2009. Since then, I've dropped like 18 projects. So, yeah, here we are. Both have decided to go down the independent path. Give me your decision and why you've done that. I've actually stayed independent my whole music career just because I want full creativity of everything I put out. I just, I want to be authentic to me and I, I don't want to change, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yourself, though. So me, I've been independent my whole career yeah. up until recently where I've signed. At first, I was independent because I had no choice. Not, it wasn't like everyone was getting signed there. Probably yeah, like yeah. one or two people get signed in the whole country. But then um, I just learned how to do things for myself. Right, guys, so we're going to go straight into a game of Gif Gaff's True or False. By your feet, you've got two paddles and it says true or false. And I want you to give the answer once I've given you the question. You too competitive? Very, Very competitive. Who's gonna, who's, who's, gonna, who's gonna win this competition? Me. Oh, I, 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 are you having that? No, but I'll let her think what she wants. <laughs> oh, you just be the gentleman right now. Are you, you go. gonna let her win as a gentleman? No, no. No? <laughs> wow. Love that. So let's get the first question in now. A footballer signed a contract in which the owner made the players eat sheep's testicles upon signing a new contract. <laughs> True or false? True or false? Give me an answer because false. this is. I feel why, like why do you feel that? It's not ethical. That just sounds. I just think you can't do stuff the like that. The owner, you said. Testicles, you know. The owner. Yeah, no. The, the owner, owner wanted the players. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he no. sheep's testicle yeah, no, upon no. signing a new deal. Sorry. No, I don't believe and if, and if any player signed that, that contract, <laughs> yeah, that's mad. I don't know for you, that's crazy. <laughs> i tell you what, right? It's actually true. No. It's yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Test signs. Yeah, testicles, man. Test what? Testicles? Testicles? Yeah. testicles. You didn't I hear thought it. you said it. No, testicles. In test signs, you thought? I'm I'm test signs is all right. That's right. No, testicles. Test well, this Who's is the what type of testicles? Uh, well, that's that, that's the. I don't know if it's. <laughs> can't be human testicles. Yeah, no, 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 no. <laughs> Animal testicles. Gonna, it's got to be. Like, that's any better. <laughs> like, yeah, well, it wasn't human. That is crazy. Yeah, man. Yeah, wow. A footballer signed a contract in which the club banned. In the, in the yeah. contract, it said that he can't wear specific. Club shirt. banned him from wearing a specific colour of boots. Is that true or false? Well, you guys are. Do you know yeah, why? I can believe this, you know. Because you? Yeah, have you I, seen, I can have you seen the David Beckham documentary? I've been watching it. Okay, but I'm obviously yeah, not. In that, that he said that he came in, when he signed the Adidas though, he came in with the white predators and Fergie said, nah, nah, <laughs> black. So I believe that. I don't know when it happened, yeah. but I believe that. Yeah, I believe that this could happen. But I was around when the first type of coloured boots yeah. came about. I was at Chelsea at the time. Yeah. I just thought, I just saw the first coloured boots ever. Yeah. You had some coloured, um, blue coloured, Adidas. No. Or the Pumas. No. Or New Balance. High techs. Well done for getting it right, though. It's true. You got it right as well, no? Yeah. A footballer signed a contract that prevented him from listening to a specific artist on match day. Wow. That could be possible. I feel like that is true. A specific artist. Yeah, I feel like that's true. I'm going to say false. Yeah, you're not having it. I feel like that's true. How, like, how? How are you banning someone? Because maybe that artist got that... Maybe that artist's music had a certain effect on a player which wasn't... But then who, like, well, how? ..positive for their performance. I don't know. And maybe the agent got involved, you know what I mean, and said, listen, by the way, when he listens to that music, it's yeah, bad he news. He said, it's bad news. It gets a bit... You know, you know what I mean? People get could be techie. sometimes. Could be techie like that, you know what I mean? Some people get really emotional 
on a certain artist or, you know? And yeah, for all we know, he could be going through it with his missus or whatever, and yeah, he's and listening makes, to certain yeah, songs. Yeah, takes and, energy and out of his plate. And he's know? emotional now, he can't get stuck in in the pitch. I don't, I don't know. It's still, possible. I'm still not having it. You're still not having it? No, I'm not having it. <laughs> I'm not having it. Why are you not having it? Because I'm just like, what has music got to do with playing football? A lot. A lot. A lot. I yeah, used to, I I used to be a DJ. I, 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 I was just going to say, but there's certain songs that you had to play before I, you got in the pitch. Yeah, but if you didn't play them songs, I, I still believe your performance would still be the same. All right, so for me, for me, if I was to go and play um, some Whitney Houston before going out to yeah. battle with Man United. That's crazy. That's crazy, isn't it? Right. <laughs> no, actually, you're wrong. <laughs> Are you serious? She's right. <laughs> it was false. OK. OK. A footballer signed a contract in which their children had to declare their support for the club at school. <laughs> Let's see what you got there. Their children had to declare. So a footballer signed a contract in which their children had to, to declare to their and support. Say, I support this team just because my dad plays there. That's that's crazy. That's True or false? Do you get that? No. Nah? Nah, I just feel like you can't force that, people. That can happen in this world, you know. So. Nah, that's not possible. No. I mean, I'm, my dad supports Liverpool and I was never going to support them, so... Why? Just, uh, well, feel, so feel, so if like... we went to work one day, yeah? If we went to work one day and then basically his manager goes to you, goes to him, goes, oh, listen, Youngs, he's got to be able to support our team and I'll give you a pay, a pay rise and he's got nah. to go to school and declare I mean, it. Yeah, that's... I'll give him a pay rise if he supports my team. But he gets a pay rise. Your dad gets a pay yeah, rise. It's nothing to do with me. I'm, I, oh, long as and you money, wanna, you wanna long do that for him? Look at this going in my so you, account. Sorry, Dad. So you wanna do that for him? Nah. No. Nah. <laughs> That's bag out of order, by the way. Rebel. I was a rebel, so my dad supported Liverpool, older brother Chelsea, my other older brother Arsenal. I was oh, what only... is going on in that household? Yeah, it's crazy. It's just yeah. it? so why why? 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 Just, I don't know, man. We all rebelled, man. Just, yeah, I mean, I just followed my dad. Oh, you followed your dad? He's a proper See, Arsenal she's got fan. no backbone. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's bad every, you know what's man? Everyone in my family is Arsenal. Oh, is it? It's like, we're just all, yeah, everyone's Arsenal. Everyone's Arsenal. That was false. The footballer signs a contract in which the owner requested birthday party appearances by the player at their child's birthday. That's like mad, isn't it? Yeah, but Don't I believe that's that. Mad? It is mad, but I, I do believe that, that was... Do you think it's false or true? Yeah, because owners have, like... They it... live in their own world, and it's like, yeah... I own after the, the testicle... I mean, yeah, anything's possible. Anything, 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 <laughs> anything, anything <laughs> is possible after the testicles, yeah. So. Yeah? Yeah, I believe this, to be honest. So you think it's, it's true? Like, that doesn't sound that crazy. I don't think it's that bad. I, I, like, you've it got sounds a mad that it's in a, a contract, though. Yeah, Because all these things are written in contract, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. yeah it's, it sounds mad that it's contract. But it's something you'd say, like, yo, bro, yeah, and you yeah, just, yeah. like, my But I feel like it could have been written as banter in the contract. Like, every in player. In a serious so contract, there's a little line of banter. Oh, every player. I thought you meant, like, just like a superstar came to the No, no, every player. Okay, that's crazy. Oh. And, and if they don't, they're breaching the contract. Yeah, yeah. yeah so what are you crazy. saying? True or false? That's true. True? Yeah. Is it not true? It's actually false. Oh, wow. Good. No, but... It's actually false. That no, one there. When you said the whole team, I should have known. I yeah, I should have known that one person. <laughs> Maybe a one-off. Yeah. OK. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's a false. Unlucky. Here's another one. A footballer signed a contract in which their goal bonus was decided by spinning the wheel of fortune Prior to kickoff. Wait, wait. Spinning a wheel. As, so you know the wheel amount, of fortune. The amount yeah. of what their goal bonus would be. Yeah. Just before the game, they spin so a wheel. So footballer signed a contract in which their goal bonus was decided by spinning a wheel of fortune prior to kickoff. I True wouldn't say false, but that sounds like something that could. False. It's true, isn't it? It's actually false, you're right. Oh, okay. <laughs> but I had a goal bonus. I'm not going to tell you how much it was. It was quite yeah. healthy. Yeah. Yeah, but it was... So um... was that not an incentive to score? Well, you wanted to score anyway, but you uh, thought, you know what? Yeah, you're okay. Well, it, I well, want to get a holiday bonus. at the end of the month. You know what I mean? Of I want to fly out the missus. Well, it didn't work Let for me because I didn't trick. score that many, did okay, I? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I was like, honest, honest player, man. Honest, like, man, you know honest I mean? man. I weren't shooting from left, right and centre. Because that could actually happen if yeah, you're not sensible. Do you know what I mean? But Wouldn't that wouldn't that also kind of make strikers greedy as well? It does. And and also, I, this is what I used to do between me and you, yeah? I used to say to whoever was going to do an assist, or who was actually, say, listen, if you're in front of goal and I'm there, yeah, pass to me and, and I'll, I'll cut you in. That is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I'll cut you in, mate, no problem. That is, that I'll give you a little drink. But they never did pass to me anyway. Yeah. <laughs> so there's a final question. 
A footballer signed a contract in which the club refused to sell the footballer to a specific club, no matter the price. 100% that is true. Because so even now, yeah. the clubs don't like to sell to rival clubs even now. Yeah. I mean, it, it happens, but could you... Do you remember when um, Tevez left to go City? Oh, yeah, yeah, like, yeah That was yeah, a big, yeah. like... Yeah, up, yeah, oh, Man United that City. Was crazy. That was crazy. Yeah, that was that mad. That was crazy. I believe that's true. Yeah, I believe it's true. I feel like once you've got a golden plate, you don't want to let them go, so. Yeah. Well done for getting it right, though. It's true. So, guys, scores have come in. What's your feeling? I feel like I won because I always win. I don't know how to lose. I think you're keeping score in your head. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think it was a draw, I'm not gonna lie. Do you reckon? I think so. Would Hopefully. you take a draw? Would you take a draw? I mean... You weren't playing for the draw, but you take one? You respect yeah, the draw? I respect the draw. OK, I've got the scores here. Ah, oh, lucky young. Can but, you get a recount? Uh, recount? Listen. Yeah, I think we need a recount. What else is it I get wrong? <laughs> Oh, but the music in the right, locker room, enough, that was... I, I, I'm a that's tip. what I've done you. That's I'm going to hold the L. I'm going to hold the L. I'm going to hold the L. I'm hold the L. All right, all right. I'm hold the L. Anyway, so it's clear that football has had its issues with contracts that promote freedom and flexibility for players. Gifgaff are changing the game when it comes to phone deals. Find out more at gifgaff.com. My name is Colton Cole. This is Pagey Cakes. And this is Young's Teflon. And this was Hold the Phone with Gifgaff. Signing out.